Congratulations are in order for Scott Strickland and the University of Florida Athletic Program because they got their new football facility opened up, and it looks fantastic. I'm going to pull up the video here and let you guys see it, but uh, we'll turn it down just a touch. How's that? But you can see it here. This is uh, Carlos Pineda, who did like a little 40-second clip. But it is awesome looking. Um, It says it's an $85 million facility. It broke ground in June of 2020. It is uh, the site of the old Alfred A. McKethan Stadium, um, which was the former home of the baseball team before they moved into the new Florida ballpark before the 2021 season. Uh, This is located next to the Stephen O'Connell Center. But it is. I'm telling you, man, this thing looks so good. I mean, just so good. I'm I'm so impressed with what they did here. Uh, just massive, massive stuff. Looking at the numbers, looking at what all they've got, it's next to the basketball arena, right? The Stephen O'Connell Center. Uh, the new training center will be considered to be one of the best in the country, including brand new weight rooms, locker rooms, a rehab facility uh, with hydrotherapy, a cabana style pool, a recording studio, barbershop, and much more. And it says, while the football team and its staff will be housed in the new facility, it will also be open to all University of Florida student-athletes with a new dining hall and lounge with the aim of connecting student-athletes across all sports. Scott Strickland, now this was approved while Dan Mullen was still the coach, but this is part of the reason why Dan Mullen is no longer the coach. Because they are willing to put in whatever they have to do to be successful as a football program. And I think that's why Billy Napier is there. And this is huge, huge for them. Uh, It was called Game Changing. Like, this is a game changer for that program. And I think it is. Urban Meyer used to complain about the fact that their facilities were not exactly up to date. I mean, that was, what, 12 years ago when he was complaining about that. So, yeah, this uh, this is something big. Heading into recruiting, et cetera, they opened this up before the season. Obviously, big things coming up now. This won't make as big of a deal as NIL, but you still have to keep up with the Joneses. You can't just let everything fall back to the wayside. Kentucky's basketball coach probably looking at this as well, going, what in the world is going on? But regardless, uh, this thing looks awesome. I, I did read something really cool about one of their training rooms. They can project a like they can project film on it, and then the players can line up in anticipation of what's going to happen from the lineup from the other team. Like, they've got a football field on the ground, and they can line up against it. Like, that is really awesome stuff. So, groundbreaking stuff, game-changing stuff for the University of Florida. Congratulations, Scott Strickland. That is a massive, massive deal. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app, and make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.